Hey everyone, this is Paul from Ignorant Nerds bringing you another in review slide joy. They've made a lot of changes to this app and um, I was afraid for it for a little bit and now I'm kind of feeling a little more iffy about it. Um, so this is an update to the other video that I made in the past. Um, the other video I made in the past goes a little bit more in depth into how the app works and what it's like to use. They haven't really changed much of that. So if you want to kind of know more about this app and how it works, go watch my old video. Um, I'll include an annotation and a link down in the description down below. Go and check that out. What this video is for is to tell you the updates that they have made um, because they're pretty significant. Um, one of the big ones that you could tell immediately that really, really irks some people is the fact that they got rid of the Google Play payout. Um, as you could tell, it's no longer on this list. Um, they had a, they had, they released a blog talking about why they did it, and they said that <clears throat> that it was too much work for them to go out and buy individual gift cards, um, scratch off the the thing on the back, and send people the codes, and they do that for every single time. They said that that was way too much work. I can kind of understand where they're coming from. That is a lot of work. But it was one of the only reasons I feel like a lot of people use the app was for the Google Play payout. And so when they took that away, I immediately looked online in a lot of different reviews and a lot of people were upset that that was gone. And another thing that they changed that I can also kind of understand, but it's kind of annoying at the same time, is you no longer get shown money here. It shows you what's called SlideJoy carrots. Um, and I can understand why they did this is because they want to show you increasing into bigger numbers, you know, because people are always happy when they see big numbers. Um, this does just transfer straight over to real money. So this would be $9.28 or $6.69 um, in real money. So the transfer is still really simplistic, but they, I think that they want to have people view larger numbers instead of viewing the number six or something like that. I would still rather have it in money just because I feel like it would be better, but um, whatever. This doesn't bug me too much. The Google Pay thing does bug me a little bit, but they have replaced it with a lot of different things. It seems like they've teamed up with um, Gift, the um, the app gift to offer gift cards and so now we have all these different choices the big one being the Amazon one on the top that's what I'm going to be using the most um, so a while back when I first did this I redeemed my um, slide joy money for a Google Play gift card and they sent me the code and the code never worked and so I was really really kind of sad and upset and I emailed them and I was like, what's what's going on? This doesn't work. And I got an automatic reply saying that they've received my email and that it's going to IT. But then I never heard back. And so I, I'm guessing that's just gone because they said that we had to redeem all of our gift cards um, before the middle of July. So I'm guessing that's just gone. But anyway, I luckily had enough money that I was able to redeem some of my carrots for an Amazon gift card. And I got that extremely fast. It was very nice. I got an email the same day saying, here's your gift card. And then I, this morning I went online, I redeemed it and I used it on Amazon this morning. And so that worked just fine and it worked great. I think teaming up with gift was a good idea. Although the loss of Google play is quite dramatic and the change into carrots is slightly annoying. Um, I can't give this one five out of five stars anymore just because of that loss. Um, but overall, the app really hasn't changed, as I said before. The layout's exactly the same. How you use it is exactly the same. Um, it's really easy to use. It just replaces your lock screen. Some of the things that they, some of the ads that they've been replacing my lock screen with have been kind of annoying. I wish I could show you the feed, but it's not loading right now. Um, some of them are like scantily clad women and different things, which is always fun when you have your phone out next to your boss or whatever, and you click to unlock it, and all of a sudden there's just like some scantily clad girl on your phone, and you're like, uh, it's just an ad. But... Yeah, so I would probably give this anywhere between three out of five or four out of five stars just because um, just because of the loss of Google Play and some of the ads have been popping up and then the switch to these carrots instead of dollars. Um, all those little things make this app a little bit 
more annoying to use. I'll probably still continue to use it because it's still probably one of the best ways to gain free money. And the fact that I can exchange it for Amazon gift cards, that makes it really, really nice and really easy to use. Um, so I would still recommend this app to anyone who is looking to get just free money from uh, unlocking your phone. It's pretty great. Um, it's pretty smooth and it's nice. So again, I recommend this app. Um, but thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe down below. That helps us out a ton. Um, Sorry if I sound a little nasally. I've been a little sick for the past week, but I wanted to get this out there to you guys. But thanks for watching. Have a great day.